forget being all in this season. The Patriots right now are all out all out of answers for a leaky offensive line, all out of excuses for suiting up Danny Amendola, and all out of embellicic we trust platitudes to explain gaping roster holes. The team that has not all in cold and tea get out of Arrowhead Stadium fast enough after getting its doors blown off in a game they were never in. The Patriots were trampled and humiliated, 41-14, by the Kansas City Chiefs on Monday night, dropping to an unimpressive 2-2 on the season. The Belichick FCS two victories are over the Minnesota Vikings, who were shell-shocked in the wake of Adrian Peterson's child abuse imbroglio and the Oakland Raiders, the NFL's perpetual black hole, not exactly the iron of the NFL. This was a system failure. The Patriots and their first family, the Crafts, waved their finger and utter TSKTSK at the notion of loading up to make a Super Bowl run, ala the Denver Broncos. It is not prudent. Woe not you just rather win 12 games in the path of least resistance if geest. They believe the system will prevail. News flash to the lords of Fort Foxborough, talented players win football games, not systems or value charts. If you don't have enough of them, or don't use them correctly, what you have is hubris and a helping of humble pie served up in cherry red on national television.